Yo, what's going on guys? Boy Vid here back on the Mad 16 Ultimate Team. And today I got you guys a pack opening, but first I'm gonna go through and quickly give you guys an update on the lineup. Uh, you're gonna notice a few things that are different. Uh demoted in some areas, uh better in some areas. Uh basically I got the 98 overall team that I needed to get. I bought fucking shit ton of players. Got the 98 overall team that I want. I got rid of some of them, demoted some of the players I didn't want that I was only holding on to because I needed the 98 overall team. Upgraded in some areas, got rid of uh VD, unfortunately. Got Antonio Gates. Gates is just so much better. I had to get him. Updated the offensive line everywhere. Uh, nothing really new down here. Besides, we got um, we got rid of uh, Marshall Falk because I didn't really like him anyways. Uh, Darren Sproles is now there. And Trent Richardson is my number two, guys. Trent Richardson is so good. Like, it doesn't like his 91 speed, but I don't know, man. I think they gave him 94 ball carrier vision for the love of God. But I don't know. That 96 truck, I'm telling you guys, I think I picked him up for like 13K. Man, I like him so far. I've only used him a few times, but I really thoroughly enjoy him. Uh, defensive side of things, we ended up getting rid of 99 Von Miller. Now we have Derek Brooks over there. Uh, still got Night Train Lane. Um, Want to move him to cornerback pretty soon here. Hopefully get the other Night Train Lane up there. Uh, got rid of... Do I still have Bobby? Actually, I think I still have Bobby Wagner. Yeah, I still have Bobby Wagner. I'm probably going to sell him. I don't really know what's going on with that. Got Bud Dupree there. Uh, got another Stefan Anthony over there. Lawrence Taylor probably going to be around much longer. Uh, I don't know what I'm going to do with that. Maybe pick back up uh, Super Bowl Malcolm Jenkins. Or not not Malcolm Jenkins. Super Bowl uh, Malcolm Schmiff. Uh, yeah, got rid of 99 Von Miller. Got rid of 96 Von Miller as well. I uh, got Boss. Not Boss. Uh, just Ultimate Legend John Randall down there. Ultimate Legend Jason Taylor. I think I'm going to get Boss Jason Taylor uh, pretty soon. I uh, bought Deacon Jones. I picked him up for like 50-something K last night. I was like a 98 overall. I, I'm probably just going to put him at uh, defensive tackle uh, 2. That's what I've been doing pretty much. I've just been taking out Jabal Sheard, putting Deacon Jones over there, putting Vic Beasley. I uh, was just pretty much using it for the overall. Actually, I'm probably going to switch it back now. Go ahead and do that now that I don't really need the overall anymore. Um... Like I said, the only reason I, the only reason I had even bought him was because I needed him for the overall challenge. And I just did that yesterday. Uh, so that's pretty much it for the team now. Um, I'm going to go ahead and open up the packs. Uh, I got 60 pro packs, but I'm going to open up these. I'm going to open up three of these captains packs. I don't even know what's in them, but I just have some uh, extra points. Might as well rip them open and see if we can get anything decent from them. Lord, okay. Thomas DeCloud, he probably goes for nothing. Um, so he's probably going to be the only thing in this pack. We're going to get a, I don't even, I don't even know who this is. I don't know any of these guys. There's just two, oh, he actually had like 90 hit power, I think. Yeah, there's the, these campus hero cards, man. Like, I don't, I don't really pay attention to much to college football. So if there's one person who's not going to know shit about any of these cards, it's, it's going to be me. Uh, okay, not the bundle. What the shit are we doing? Okay. Uh, we got one more to open after this. Wow, 375 is in a row. Let's get it. And we're going to get a Gary Barnage. Let's go. I was hoping I'd pull him. Gary Barnage is an absolute beast, guys. 6'6", 90 speed, 84 run black, 90 catch, 85 release, 88 route running, 97 catch in traffic. Like, I couldn't justify selling VD to replace him with Gary Barnage. But I was using the team of the Gary, Gary Barnage for a long time. This card is amazing. Also, another amazing card is the final edition Darius Slay. But I am very happy with that Barnage pool. I don't know how much he's going for. I don't really care. Campus Hero. Ryan Kerrigan. Wow. Dante Moncrief. I don't even know he had a card. What's he looking like? 95 speed. Wow. I remember last year Dante Moncrief's uh, Rising Star was an absolute glitch. This card looks very nice, too. 69 loose. This is a little low. 96 jumping. Those nice 95 spec catch. This is a really good card. He's probably not going for much either. Wow, that's really nice. I wonder what final edition this is to. I seriously have no clue. I guess new final edition dropped. I haven't really been paying attention to the new content lately. I uh, got one more uh, Campus Hero pack. See what we could get out of it. Wow, these packs look to be pretty good. I should have scooped this bundle, to be honest. Wow, that pack was lit. That's like one of the best packs I've ever opened. Got a Campus Hero patch. Nah, those don't go for shit. Fred Davis. I actually know who that is. Uh, DeMarcus Ware. Oh, whoa, oh, $40 pool. Let's go. I think everyone's pulling this guy, though. Like, I checked Twitter, and, uh, someone had pulled him. I, so I doubt he's going for anything. But I do know he's, like, the best. I think he's one of the basketball guys. Um, like, April Madness or something. Some EA thing. Uh, but it is a $40 card, so maybe it is going for something. Probably not. Uh, I actually want to check. Hopefully I don't piss you guys off too much doing this. But I would like to see how much he's actually going for. Um, there he is. 
Yeah, I seen they got a bunch of these cards. Yeah, like I said, I'm pretty sure everyone was pulling this guy. Uh, but they added a bunch of them, and I'm gonna pick up that Donovan McNabb. I like there's there's two Eagles players that dropped Donovan McNabb and Connor Barwin. I was really excited about that. Um, at the auction, but like I'm gonna scoop up a few more pro packs and then jump into the massive 60 that I have already. So let's just open up the rest of these points that uh, I have sitting over. So rip open these pro packs like I always do. You guys know I don't sit here forever because I, I, I you know, these videos fuck 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 packs. Okay, fuck packs. We all know why I'm doing this anyways. Got to get that silver master set. Those other packs I was actually trying to get some good pulls with those campus uh, hero packs and those packs are really nice. Blake Bortles, 74 overall card. He goes to the captain sets. So he'll probably sell for like 5k, which is more than base elites at this point. So that's not bad. Um. I think, yeah, it's going to be our last one that we could pull with points, and then we're going to have to go pull the other ones, the ones that I bought. So let's go ahead and jump into these pro packs, get ourselves a Donovan McNabb, sell Michael Vick because I hate him. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about Michael Vick. He's just been really upsetting me lately. I think, it's, I think it is time for a change. I'm tired of just seeing his face. But the only reason I was keeping him was because he was a 99 overall. There's Trent Richardson. He was a 99 overall, and I needed the uh, the 89 or the 98 overall team. So now that 99 Donovan McNabb is out, though, I might end up scooping him. I don't know how much he's going for, um, but I might end up scooping him. Uh, but I'm definitely not going to have Vic on my team much longer. That's for sure. Uh, I, I made a uh, pact with myself to never get another Marcus Mariota card this game. So as much as I would love to be using the all-rookie card, um, unfortunately, I'm not going to be using that card. But I would really, really like to. I'm not. It's it's kind of like a thing that I have. I would definitely suggest you guys to use that all rookie Marcus Mariota card. That card is an absolute beast. Um, but uh, I can't, can't, I can't go against myself here. And I told myself I wasn't going to use him because he done pissed me off in a game a really long time ago in the beginning of the year. Uh, whenever I was using his team of the the very first team of the week card he got, I think it was an 85 overall. And it had like it was like one of the best quarterbacks at the time. Like it had the best throwing stats and the best speed for quarterbacks. And he overthrew a drag route and it got intercepted and I lost the game because of it. So I was like, okay, no Marcus Mariota's for the rest of the year. And it actually I actually kind of kind of stuck to it. The only time I ever used him was to get gameplay. Whenever I pulled him, I used him to get gameplay for you guys. Uh, but that was it. I, I I had him in my lineup, but I never used him. The only reason I had him in my lineup was because uh, I had to hold him for the captain. So anyway, wow, 95 speed for this guy. Jesus goodness. Oh, Justin Gilbert, I know who that is. Uh, let's just keep ripping open these packs. I got it. I'm good. I'm glad I got to open these packs too, because I was running low on contracts. That's like the only time, only reason I open up packs anymore for contracts and for bronze players. And I am actually making pretty good progress in the uh, in the silver and bronze player sets. Like it's got to the point to where I'm. I'm sure, like, a good percentage of these cards won't even fit. Like, I did the bronze for a lot of the teams. I mainly just need silvers now. Um, so I'm sure a lot of these cards are just going to end up going into badge sets anyways at this point, which is alright. Because I still need a few elite badges for uh, Marcus Allen. Wow, these pro packs are incredibly dry. Um, I think we have, what are we, what were we, I think we opened up 18 so far. I already forgot. What was that? We got two golds. Dem, Damon, Desmond, Desmond, Desmond Bishop. Uh, I don't think he goes to any sets. Was that Randall Cobb? We're gonna pull. I don't think we pulled a single elite from these yet. Come on, give me a McNabb. Hit it. Oh, oh my God! I need a Donovan McNabb. Where the hell is Donovan McNabb? Well, that's nice hair there. Oh, that left tackle. I can see his name, but his hair was flowing. Chris Clark. Let's hit him with the reveal all cheese. Anything? Anything? No. No, not at all. The left. Uh, Sebastian Janikowski and Eric Berry. Sebastian Janikowski might be going for like 4 or 5k. So that's probably the best pull I've gotten out of Pro Packs so far. Uh, Tyler Eifert. He had a great year this year, actually. It was, uh, kind of surprised me. Kind of surprised me how well he played. Oh, these Pro Packs are incredibly dry. There's Vance McDonald. I actually have him. I have two of him. A lot of people sleep on that Easter card because he's going for so cheap. But I promise you guys, you guys should definitely pick up a Vance McDonald. He's got like 92 run block and like a pretty good amount of speed. Um, I would definitely, definitely, definitely uh, use him if I was you guys as your fullback, or maybe even your blocking tight end. Time to get rid of Hardstock. I still use Hardstock. I use Hardstock and him, but at 92 run block, you really can't go wrong, and he's only going for like 10k. So we get a Phil Dawson. He might go in for about 5k too. This pro pack's looking very dry. 
Man, I should have got those Campus Hero bundle. There's Darius Slave. We only got the final. We need to get the final edition Darius Slave. Come on, EA. Juice up these pro packs. This is horrible. Steven Ridley. Jesus Christ. Please. Wow. Ah. Kyle Long. Get out of my packs. Wow, that guy looked fucking weird looking. We're down to 27 left. We've already opened up half. We haven't even gotten one elite yet out of these things. I used all my my luck on freaking Campus Hero packs. Come on, man. Come on, man. 75s, man. He's just horrible. Joe Kruger. I wonder if he's related to Paul Kruger. I think he had an Eagles jersey on too. Philip Rivers, come on. <sighs> Madden Gods, put something. Give me a single. Ooh, ooh, wow. Three golds in one pack. Fire. Fire. We get that's a fire pack. David Amerson. Alright, give me the Easter David Amerson now. I wonder if they're gonna release Easter packs again. I'm like, I'm kind of wondering. They only had Easter packs around for a little bit, and a lot of those cards are still way expensive. Like, three of the cards are still well over a mil. I'm like, ugh. Goodness. I'm probably going to sell those Easter cards and just take the L. Because doing the Dick Lane set is just not a good idea. Like, I added a bunch of players to the set already. Like, all the, a lot of the gold players and, like, all the A collectibles. But I think I'm just going to take an L on that shit. Because in the players alone you have to buy for that it is going for more than the Dick Lane, I'm pretty sure. Because uh, you still need, like, three players for, like, a, for like uh, a mil a pop. A little bit more than that. So I still got like 3.3 .3 mil worth of players to buy. Probably more than that. And uh, yeah, I'm just probably, wow, Thomas Davis is probably going to be our only elite. This is horrible. Wow, pro packs are not the move today. Wow, definitely, definitely should have got the campus hero. I should have, I'm like, I should have, I should have waited. I should have just opened up the three campus hero, seen how fire the packs were. And then decided from there whether I was going to get pro packs with the Campus Hero packs. I kind of just looked at the topper and I was like, that topper's booty. The topper just guarantees a Campus Hero card. It could be a gold or an elite. Um, so I looked at that and I was like, no. This this is probably going for like a singular K. Actually, right outside linebacker just came out. So maybe that is going for a little bit. Because I'm pretty sure those go for a decent amount when the card first comes out. Maybe, sort of. Because I pulled, or I didn't pull, my friend pulled uh, the left outside linebacker one, the Anthony Barr one. I think it sold for a pretty penny. I think right outside linebacker, Sean Lee. I didn't even get to see the card. I was looking in the auction block for it yesterday. I didn't even see it up there. Um, I need to find a middle linebacker. Do I'm just using Bud Dupree out of position because I'm like, I don't even know how to use. There are like no middle linebackers with decent speed that aren't going for like a gabillion and can play by themselves like without using them. Because as much as I would like to get Ryan Chazier, Marcus Mariota, as much as I would like to get Ryan Chazier, they're the 94. That dude plays like buns when you leave him alone. That's the problem. There's Michael Kendricks. I want the 97 Michael Kendricks so bad, but he is going for so much. I just can't I can't justify spending that much on it. But I would probably keep him for the rest of the year, to be honest. Like, 97 overall is decent enough to keep throughout the year. And I'm going to be doing an All-Eagles team soon, eventually, anyway. So it's not... It's, that's not out of the question. So we might end up getting him at some point. Maybe not soon. So after this, we got two more packs to open. Well, out of 60 Pro Packs... We pulled like one elite. That is horrible, 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 horrible. Uh, strong safety. That one also just come out. I think that one also just came out. Um, I don't remember who it is. All right, so that's gonna be the end of the pack opening. Jesus Christ, that was horrible. Uh, well, sorry. I guess that was that was that was just fucking horrible. That was that was horrible. All right, sorry guys, I lied. Actually, this did end up pretty well. I had a feeling. This was going to be decently expensive, but uh, usually the collectibles are pretty bad. But I guess when they first come out, they are actually decently expensive. So I guess that was a pretty good pull, actually, out of Pro Packs, 200 something K uh, for that one. Um, I remember the Anthony Barr one was super expensive, but I doubt any of these are. Yeah, see, these ones are probably booty. I didn't check the Strong Safety one. What is that? Uh, okay, nice, nice. Whopping amount. Um. Yeah, so I guess we're going to end the video now, guys. So if you guys like the video, give it a like. What the fuck is going on over there? What happened? What the fuck happened on the left? That is... Jesus Christ. If you guys like the video, give it a like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on Twitter. It'll be down in the description below. Don't forget to check out the uh, Single Back Tight Slots and the Gun Bunch Week videos and playlists. And as always, guys, be.